What's up guys, I'm coming at you today with the Igloo Trailmate Journey 70. This guy right here, I just picked up from Dick's Sporting Goods. Uh, this is what it looks like uh, when you grab it from the store. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and dig in and show you some of the features. All right, so the first thing you wanna notice is it has here a dry storage. Okay, it's rubberized. You can put your phone in here, uh, your keys, uh, stuff like that. It will absolutely fit. You got plenty of room uh, to put in probably two phones and maybe a set of keys. And if you come down a little further, you got a little storage pouch here. This is plastic. And uh, you can put your sunscreen in there and stuff. And everything's uh, stainless steel uh, rivets and uh, screws and stuff like that. So it's pretty good as far as build quality, I feel. Now, first thing you want to notice is these things have these little triggers. Both sides of them have it. So to open this, on one hand, you're going to have to pull this out, and this creates your little carry handle. All right, so a pretty nice carry handle. Uh, what you'll notice, another thing here is a bottle opener. you got one on each side. There's one there. And there's one there. All right, another thing you'll notice, you got these little tie-down strap hook things on all sides here and here. Here's a look at the hinge for the back. Uh, this I'll get to in a moment. Those are uh, for rod holders that come with it. Uh, you also have four uh, cup holders here. And another thing here that you'll notice is the wheels are oversized. Real nice, real easy to pull. All right, diving into the cooler. First thing you're going to notice is it has a front opening, which I really like. It opens from the front. Uh, so it doesn't matter which side you're on, uh, you can just open it from the front there. And this is what you'll be met with when you open it. Uh, first thing I'm going to talk about here is this butcher tray, they call it. I bought this for my niece. Uh, she's going to be able to come to the beach with us and she will be able to sit here and eat. And a uh, cool thing about that too, look, you can pull this down. And you have a little slot. Oops, make sure I put that in there noticed that that this got hung this right here got hung on this so you just gotta be careful with that I did notice all right so you push down on it and it's got this little slot right here and you can set up your phone uh, for the kid to watch while she's eating or he's eating right all right all right so back inside we see these rod holders uh, these guys just kind of go on the outside here just like this Okay, those are your rod holders if you want to fish. You can use this for fishing. Uh, you have a food basket here. All right, it slides back and forth real nice. And uh, that's basically it, guys. Uh, overall, it's really nice. Um, it says that it holds uh, four days for ice. I don't really believe that. This is the pamphlet that it comes with. Um, four days is kind of a stretch. Maybe in the shade, maybe three. You're not going to get... It's not a Yeti, okay? But you're also running... Uh, it's got a lot more... Uh, features in the Yeti, right? But it also, uh, it's cheaper, right? All right, so there's some of the things it has, oversized wheels, has a glide handle. If you wanna pause the video so you can read these better, you can. Dry storage, all right? Talking about the mobile device stand, bottle openers and stuff. All right, so it comes in many colors. Uh, they got them at Dick's. You can find them on Amazon if you want. Um, I wanted to see it in person. Four days. I don't know if I agree with that. Um, but yeah. All right. And that's it. All right, guys. Hope you liked the video. Uh, like and subscribe if you learned something.